job. 19 years old, I worked at Disney World, and I worked with Harrison Ford every day for three months. There he is. That's actually robot Harrison Ford. This is the great movie ride. I worked there. I passed by that guy, robot Harrison Ford, 200 times a day. So when I met the real Harrison Ford, I figured, hey, we share a special bond. Well, I, I figured wrong. And I work with the robot Harrison Ford. Uh, I don't know how to relate to that at all. I had no idea there was a robot. Harrison. You didn't know this? No. He, at, at nine hours a day, this robot Harrison Ford. Ugh, ugh, ugh. That's all you did nine hours a day at Disney World. Uh, well, it's a dirty job, but somebody's got to do it. <laughs> you were fantastic. You really were. Thank you. I'll tell you what, though. You ought to be in the Hall of Presidents as a robot, because this, this study came out, survey. They said, who would you most want to be a leader, a president? And you know, like 40% of Americans said Harrison Ford. The relationship between the character I play and Ender is, is both mentor and manipulator. And maybe that's, uh, that's a clue to what goes on in the real process of being a national leader, is that you're, you appear to be mentor, but you're really manipulator. You're preserving your political opportunities and the, and the opportunities for your, your party more often than not. See there? Mentor and manipulator.